Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Alan Chavez. I am the CTO at Clavio. We, we, we think of ourselves as a unified customer platform. Um, and it's composed of three parts. Uh, there's a customer database at the bottom, experiences at the top, where you allow our customers to uh, create messages, personalized messages to their customers uh, and submit them either through email or SMS. Uh, and then at the top of that, we see ourselves as a company that builds intelligence uh, through uh, data science into our product, just so our customers can uh, have the help that they need in order to do uh, the communication to their customers. I've been here like two and a half years. Every year I've doubled the engineering team and we're doing that again this year. So it's in the hundreds uh, is the number that we have um, for engineers. What, what I usually say to, to uh, candidates is that whatever your interests are, we actually are trying to solve that problem. So if your interest is in uh, high throughput data ingestion uh, and uh, manipulation of data, uh, we have that. We process billions of events uh, through hundreds of integrations with third parties. So we're always trying to solve that problem in a performant way. If your interest lies in uh, creating solutions that customers love, user experiences that customers love, we, have, uh, we are completely revamping our user experience with a new design system. Uh, if your interests are in the data science using machine learning to add intelligence to a software in a way that uh, helps customers, we have that in spades. Uh, if your interest is in uh, uh, doing processing at scale and integrating with third parties to send messages, emails, SMS, we have that in, in, in spades. If your interest is in creating a platform uh, that uh, empowers third party developers, we're investing on that too. So uh, we have really, really interesting projects uh, going on in all of these areas. We just need help with them. We're not very religious about technology, but just as a result of uh, where the company's journey has been, uh, we are primarily a Python uh, shop. Uh, in terms of uh, data store, we have a lot of uh, relational, uh, MySQL and Postgres. Uh, we also use Cassandra, we use ClickHouse, uh, and of course, everything is uh, hosted in the public cloud, in our case, in AWS. Uh, we have some uh, parts of the system that use other languages like Java, but for the most part is, is Python. So here's what we are testing, we're assessing candidates on. Uh, one is uh, learning or slow, your ability to learn and continue to evolve. Why? Well, <laughs> tech industry, if you stop learning uh, in six months, a year, it's really, you are uh, completely outdated. Uh, number two is problem solving. So, and I specifically said problem solving, not a specific knowledge of the technology, because technologies, given the first point, people will learn. But we are trying to assess how is that given a real world problem, a problem that you would face in your day to day, how is that you do that problem? So our interview process is geared towards really practical problems, either design uh, uh, problem or a coding problem that is you're gonna face in your job uh, day to day. Uh, and then finally, we are assessing for something that's really important to us, which is your fit. And that is about, are you a great collaborator? Uh, not only with the engineering team, but across. Uh, do you make the teams that you are part of better than they are without you? So we are trying to assess all three parts uh, in the interview process. Uh, and uh, we have had tremendous success because the people that we're hiring really hit the, all three points that I just described. I guess I would describe that uh, no ego, collaboration, learning, uh, and the realization that we, you, we're part of a winning team. We're seeing a lot of success in the marketplace, helping customers. With that, we face thorny technical problems that we need to solve. So it's this endless loop of really interesting problems to tackle that are solving real customer problems that we need to solve as a team. 
So the culture is all of this uh, to get customer orientation, the ability to learn or this learning culture and uh, the, the, the fact that we are always having to evolve our technology to just support the levels of scale that we see. What we actually provide uh, engineers and employees, for instance, an unlimited uh, budget for books. It doesn't have to be technical books, whatever makes you better uh, and it's unlimited. The ability to go to conferences and learn. So we preach what we, we, we say, right? Which is, uh, uh, we want you to be learning. We want people that are acclaimed to continue to evolve and have, uh, what we usually say uh, internally is, uh, we want to create uh, the, a place where engineers have uh, the be- can do the best work of their lives here at Clavio. Some place that in the future, when they look back, they're gonna say, you know what? The work I did at Clavio was the best work of my career. Why? Because uh, the environment that I had, the opportunities that I had to grow and the problems that we were trying to solve from a customer and technical standpoint. That's what we're striving for uh, as part of the culture. Clavio is a company that is, has been growing like crazy. Uh, what I mean by that is not only the number of customers, we have hundreds of thousands of customers using our platform. Each one of those customers is actually increasing the, the, the usage of the platform. It's just that sticky. Uh, and uh, we are looking to continue to evolve the technology, continue to solve the existing customer problems that we see, and expand in uh, uh, different product areas that are adjacent to what we do today. Uh, and all in the company with a, of a lot of talent that you can be sure to learn from and teach to uh, in an environment that is absolutely, uh, it's hard to explain when you're not inside Clavio. Is that feeling that there's a winning team, we're solving these problems, customers are super excited about what we do. The, the, the problems that we're trying to solve are so interesting uh, that it just produces a great uh, environment to grow your career uh, in the future. Mm-hmm.